I want to show you how we improve conversion on pixelyourside.com using social proof. I'm talking about these tiny little messages right here. You've seen them, wait a minute, where, well, this one. You've seen them on other websites. Uh, they are quite popular. And in order to generate these messages, we have our own plugin that you can actually buy or get on pixelyourside.com. It's called the Boost plugin. We call these boosts. So I will use boost instead of messages quite often. Uh, this plugin is very uh, easy to use and it's integrated with WooCommerce. It's integrated with easy digital downloads. Uh, it's integrated with a number of form plugins, very popular WordPress forms. And it has a trigger that can capture data from actually any form. So it doesn't matter if we have a direct integration with a form plugin, we can detect the form and get the data from there. It's super simple and very very uh, intuitive in or when 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 you use it uh, by the way if some users are annoyed by these messages we have a close button and if you click on the close button they will disappear for the next 24 hours for that user so uh, if you consider them intrusive it's easy to stop them uh, we also have something quite interesting uh, we have if you don't know we have a consent plugin uh showing uh, the usual consent uh, message on a website like this and uh, when the constant message is visible there are no boosts okay so nothing bothers me and if i open the constant pop-up again the boosts will go away until i close the pop-up so uh it's very well integrated with Constant magic as well. It doesn't bother you when you need to uh, express your consent or something like that. Let me show you uh, how it looks in the back end. In the back end, this is uh, the plugin. Right now, I don't have any boost configured on my demo website. I will make one just to explain uh, the basic steps. We have WooCommerce, easy digital downloads, integrated forms, and any form. I will make um, a boost for WooCommerce because it's probably very popular uh, let's name it select the trigger and now i have uh, the option to create boosts for transactions for a specific category transaction so only products from a particular category will trigger the messages for stock messages basically uh, you can show a message when the stock is under a particular limit for a product and you can say this product has only, I don't know, three items in stock, so buy it now, don't miss it, something like that. And we can also capture add to cart clicks, so it's not necessary to uh, have a transaction, we can capture add to cart, but I will go with transaction, it's the most uh, easy to see and to understand. Continue. Now, you can customize the... Um, message using dynamic um, keywords like this for the name the name of the person uh, by the way we will not show the full name of the person we will show uh, the first name in full and only the first letter from the second name so uh, we don't uh, show personal data with these messages uh, and you can of course remove any uh, data from here you can write everything you want it's up to you and then you can customize the design like this choose one or multiple templates different template for mobile if you want you can use product images maps and icons disable any of them it's up to you now you have a very flexible display condition where to show your boost all pages you can exclude some pages custom settings there are various uh, condition that you can um, add right here i will simply show it on all pages then the the location of the messages usually it's um, this one but you have the option to select a different location uh, for mobile it's top or bottom or you can disable mobile or you can disable uh, desktop and continue. 
Now you will see the final setup and save and close. Now, uh, when you have an order, we will start to get the data and transform it into a nice boost. But you can also go to settings and regenerate existing orders. So uh, you don't have to wait for, I don't know, a day or two to have enough messages to, to have activity on the website. You can use existing orders. Uh, here you can decide how many orders to get for the boost. Usually it's 100, you can change the number. And regenerate boost button. It will populate the data with um, your order data. And you can see it right here. If you need, uh, you can delete all data, you can select and delete just some of them, or you can edit, change uh, various parts of, of the captured data. Um, we also have something quite interesting. We have a list of banned words. Uh, there are almost 600, 6,000, sorry. You can add your own banned, banned words. You can edit or delete uh, the ones that uh, are default here the idea is uh, not to show i don't know nasty words on the front end of, the, of your website so this is how it works if i go and refresh the page of my demo website i will start to see those nice boosts for example this one and i can click the link and uh, see the product that was bought by someone so uh, it's very very easy to use i will show you how to create other how to use other triggers in different videos uh, just a quick um, just a quick review of the super nice any form uh, trigger uh, you simply have to copy the URL of the page with the form like this. Click go. And now simply select the, the form from this list. In, in this case, a forminator form. And then map the first name and the last name fields. This way we know where to look for the, na for the name of the person filling the form and click continue. The process is uh, pretty similar. You can, by the way, we automatically detect the location of the person. You don't, uh, you, they don't need to fill it in the form. We do this uh, automatically. Continue. Again, set up the display conditions. Uh, sorry, I want to show you something. The default setup, it's on the uh, forms URL page. So on this page, but you can show the, the boost messages on other page, page, pages if you want to. Prefer like this, review and publish. So it's very easy. Uh, well, if I started, let me brag a little bit. Well, I told you that we have boost integration with a number of form plugins. They work like this. If we detect the plugin for, in this case, I have contact form seven installed and uh, forminator. Um, I select forminator, for example. Then I select one of the forms that we find in, inside the plugin. And again, map the names and continue creating the, the, the boost. So it's very, very intuitive and flexible. It works with commerce, it works with forms. You can configure your uh, options. Uh, some of the settings that we have on the settings page are very, very useful. For example, you can disable give us credit and uh, the link to our website will go away, this one, if you want. I, I would like to, to have credit. It's a non-follow link, so it doesn't pass any uh, juice from your website. Uh, I will enable random order because 
this way it will not be visible how much uh, how many cells you have uh, so it's more private like this and you can enable the close button on the boost messages if you turn this option on the boost will have a nice close button that will make them disappear for the next 24 hours for a particular user for the user that clicked on the button so once you you are done you save the settings you can also translate in your preferred languages the uh, default words visible on the boost so easy to use flexible uh, and available on pixelrsi.com i think it's a nice plugin you should consider having one having one installed on your website and uh, try to see how it goes for you by the way this plugin is part of our bundle plus license so if you have one of these two licenses bundle plus agency costing uh, 799 or bundle plus advance costing 269 dollars 269 dollars uh, you gain access to the boost if you already have this license check your account you have the boost plugin um, there already if you don't have this one of these licenses already you can upgrade the license we have a link right here how to upgrade to the bundle license or you can buy the boost plugin individually from uh, this dedicated page on pixelersite.com uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, thank you very much. I'm Christian Stoichescu from Pixel Your Site. Like, share, and subscribe.